let me just express this appreciation um, that we have reached this point in which we are finally, finally launching uh, what I believe will stand out as a you know, groundbreaking initiative, particularly working with the chief financial officers, the people who sit with the uh, private pairs with public finances who look after the money of the private sector. So it's a very important moment for us. I am honored and privileged to be the MEC of Finance. I stand up before the legislature, the people of the province, and announce a budget. This year we announced 493 billion rands and said this is the money for infrastructure, for paying salaries, um, and of course for goods and services in Gauteng province. That's a powerful brick. But when we go spend it, we spend it alone as provincial government. We put, we put it on our priorities alone. It doesn't make an impact. It's isolated. It's a drop in the ocean. It's there. But imagine if we threw this round table. We then say to the CFOs, where are your companies going? What are you looking for that will make you happy in this province? Are we putting our money where we'll put a smile on you, make you happy and you expand your investment, introduce new business initiatives? So the way this partnership will work is, we shouldn't, uh, MMC of Finance in the city of Chobek, uh, Mr. Tatam is here. He runs a budget of about 80 billion. But the way that money is spent, the way we spent it, the way the private sector spent it, we are not having conversations. So the way we want this to work is, is let's attack one project, one initiative together. Let's work together. Let's move into that space. Let's go into that space. We will create, we will bring land, we'll bring bulk infrastructure. You bring your own investments, we cut costs, we make sure that um, bureaucracy, red tape, the number of days it takes to put up a fixed investment in an area, we've got to shorten that. The, the best cities, the best places in the world, it takes much more shorter time to set up an investment. Here it takes long. So one of the things we're looking at is, can we say to municipalities, and we're going to do a pilot, I want to start this pilot before the end of this year. The pilot should be, take one municipality and say, what does it mean to cut red tape in this municipality? What are the common issues? to make it easier for people to do business, to shorten the turnaround times, to make sure that you don't just leave the investment plan with the investor, but we have got people in a municipality whose job is to look at this investment initiative. These people want to build a factory. They take that step, walk it literally, step by step, ticking the boxes, and say to an investor sitting in China, in the US, in, 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 in any country, your investment is here, we left with 10 days. Your investment is here with left with one day. So we need to create a suite of services in a municipality powered by smart technologies, virtual platform, um, internet of things, to be able to converse. People don't have to take many trips to just come and check, hey, where's my investment? So the, the, the way this is going to work is if we can sort out the red tape, if we can create capacity in a municipality to work with investors, I can tell you, with the opportunities we have here, we will be one of the best uh, attractive places for investments. That's going to create jobs. It's going to give municipalities money. So the quick win for me and where we are going, if we can invest in cutting red tape, in making it easy, then it's easier to work on other things. Because remember that office will then tell us where our initiatives are going to and what are the concerns of investors. As it stands now, I deliver the budget. I have not listened to my counterparts in the private sector. They are very critical. They don't know where we are going to. We don't know where they are going to. We have got to end that. We can't be spending money in Houting in different corners. Let's bring the money together. Let's harmonize it. Let's integrate it. Let's make sure that we get value for money.